homes for young Kiwi families. Question number seven, Jamie Lee Ross. Yeah, my question is to the Minister of Transport and asks, does he stand by all his actions and statements on fuel taxes? The Honourable Phil Twyford. Yes, when described and reported accurately. Mentry. Will he provide an assurance that his Auckland regional fuel tax will only be paid by Aucklanders and not spread to taxpayers outside of Auckland? I can confirm, Mr Speaker, that it is a regional fuel tax. Does he agree with the founder of Petrol Price Monitoring Company, Gaspy, that fuel companies appear to be rising prices ahead of the 11 cents per litre Auckland Regional Fuel Tax, which comes into effect on July 1? I haven't seen that report, Mr Speaker. Is taking action on anti-competitive behaviour by the petrol companies. We're progressing the Commerce Bill to give the Commerce Commission more teeth. My colleague, the Minister of Energy, the Honourable Megan Woods, called in BP recently over their statements, and I've directed officials to monitor uh, any price spreading. The petrol companies can be under no mistake what our view is of anti-competitive behaviour. If there are indications that's going on, we will deal with it. Order, order. Can I just ask the Leader of the Opposition to just wind it back a little bit, <coughs> both frequency and volume. If he hasn't seen that report, what is his explanation then for why retail petrol prices increased by 9.3 cents per litre across the South Island over the last month, but only 1.7 cents in Auckland? It's true uh, that there is inconsistent pricing within the petrol industry. It is not a perfectly competitive market, but our government's committed to sending a very clear signal to the petrol companies that we want the best possible deal for consumers and we're willing to use the tools like the regional fuel tax to invest in a better transport system in our country's biggest city. Point of order. A point of order, Jamie Lee Ross. Mr Speaker, I asked the Minister what his explanation was. In fact, he was, he was talking to the Minister when I was providing figures, so probably didn't even hear it. But, Mr Speaker, he didn't provide any explanation at all. And, and he both addressed the question and almost certainly improperly replied to the irrelevant injections. Submentary. Jamie Lee Ross. Given he's in denial about fuel price spreading as a result of his Auckland regional fuel tax, does he accept that he is just as bad as BP and he'll be on Megan Wood's naughty step fairly soon? <laughs> order, order. <laughs> Any? No, well, it's, it's clearly ruled out for irony. The member knows it. Uh, question number eight, Jamie Strange. What Speaker, uh, my question is to the Minister of Education. 